Hey, what can I get you? Uh, mince pie, thanks. Will you be having a drink with that? Yeah, okay. Give us a can of Coke, please. Okay, let's see. That'll be $5.50. Cheers. Have a good day. Real good. See ya. Hey, what can I get you? Will you be having a drink with that? Okay, let's see. That'll be $5.50. Cheers. Have a good day. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Pi. I hope your day's been wonderful. For me, it's been a busy and full-on day. My initial thoughts and plans were that I could work from home and that this would enable me to get a little bit of marking done. But that was not to be the case, as one of the classes that I'd planned to do with Zoom, um, who I was hoping the students could come in and use the room without necessarily being supervised by me. In the end, I decided to go with the supervision and I went in. And I was very pleased that I did, actually, because what I then did was I took a few bits and bobs, my um, web camera and stuff, and tried to set up the room so that I could do a Zoom meeting from it as well as have students in the room. And I managed to uh, achieve what I think is going to be a workable solution for that. And so, yes, I'm going to try that tomorrow with my class. I'm quite looking forward to it, to be, to be fair. So um, I got that sort of established. Uh, as it turned out, only about two or three students turned up uh, to the class amongst, amongst all the sort of turmoil and chaos that is going, from, uh, going into uh, the level two with the uh, COVID or coronavirus. Now, at the end of the day, uh, this meant that I'd only had a, a few thousand steps. So what I thought I'd do was, well, instead of just driving home, what I would do was go um, for a bit of a walk before I drove home. And that's what you're seeing here is my uh, little bit of a walk uh, here and took a few pictures. Um, I also, uh, what I did was uh, for my TikToks today, I did a couple of little TikToks there that I hope are for um, non-English speakers to be able to practice. So I set up a scenario and uh, then I left out the bit where they could practice and fit that in. I don't know how it's going to go. It's just a little idea that I'm developing and, well, you know, who knows, it might help someone. So that was it for my day. Uh, that's the Kiwi vernacular I'm talking about, or Kiwi English, uh, not the uh, Queen's English um, that, uh, yeah, that's sort of uh, our local our local brand here. Five, two, four, three steps, uh, got over the five grand, 5k, awesome. One, two, one, oh, stepping out. Um, over at Where, What, Who, I've decided to let it run. It's got a bit uh, interesting with the comments and questions and things like that and I think it's it's very close uh, there I don't think I can really add too much to d direct it towards the right answer but we'll try a full comment uh, t or um, video tomorrow night if we need to so f classes of four hours admin four and the weight was pleasingly down at 83.55 and I'm feeling so much better from doing my 5,000 steps a day. I feel way more flexible. It's quite amazing. Bloody marvellous, almost. Put the number of countries whose territory goes through the Arctic Circle in the comments below the video. When Howie's in the forest heaven, he's able to answer the questions, and he knew that a mountain range is a called a Sierra as a geographical feature and he put that comment in the comments below the video and now he's on the Hall of Fame for the second day in a row. Well done Howie and thanks to everybody who watched, commented, liked and subscribed. I certainly appreciate your support and look forward to catching up with you next time you drop by. Well good, cheers, fuel the jet. This has been a Mario presentation, recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud, a place where Kiwis live, in a paradise we like to call God's own country.